Okay, first off, ignore, ignore the noise in the background. The dryer is just running. Because today is Sunday, and that means it's laundry day! But seriously, in all honesty, this is going to be a quick video about this um, vintage Seth Thomas clock that I got earlier this month off of eBay. I mean, could I use another electric clock? Maybe. But this one's kind of special. Not really special, but um, <clears throat> I remember seeing this many, many years ago at an old Winn-Dixie when we were still stationed near Fort Hood. So, whatever. And I always remember seeing this. And then... When we moved back here in 89, I remember seeing this style at like an old Walgreens, which the Walgreens moved out, but the building is still there. I doubt the clock is still there, but whatever. And I wanted one like this for a long, long time, and I had the opportunity to get one, and I got one, but it ended up being the one with the other style numbers. I mean, I may do, but this one, I want it, and I grabbed it. So, take a look at it. I mean... There's literally no model number on this. The only thing that says, do not store cord near stem or whatever. I can't remember what it says. And that has the plastic motor. And I haven't hung it up yet because I need to see how well it'll stay running. Because when I plugged it in, it made that grinding noise. And it kept bouncing around like that old West Clocks used to do. And I doused it with Zoom Spout and all that neat stuff. So what I'm probably going to do, I'll probably end up, like next week, hang it up and replace either one of these two, probably that one. I haven't really decided. So yeah. Another quick video. Another one of something useless. So until next time, I'm Miski. Thanks for watching. Comment box is open.